I've seen this place grow and develop. I've seen the place move from one location to the other and how new constructions were built and how just basically it changed from AP to IB and things like that. Like learning, the school also evolved in a process. The school has evolved tremendously from the first year I was here. At present, we are at the stage of Camelot and we are really moving forward. The school is more and more geared towards student center. Lately, we've seen new people come in who have a lot of experience and who seem to fit in really well in, uh, in the picture that we have for the future of the school. Uh, we brought the IB Diploma program in three years ago and that really encourages integration of subjects and the teachers that have come in have taken that to heart. With the IB, we really believe in global citizens. So our mission statement is go big and the B is for balanced individual, the I is for independent thinkers, and the G is for global citizens. Once we wrote our mission, we realized that the IB did a better job of helping us to reach our, our mission than the, the AP did. We're finishing our second year of uh, diploma students in the IB, and so we're working within the program and still discovering more about it as we go. Um, it's certainly a challenge, it's certainly I think our students feel like they're working hard and being challenged in many classes at once. The faculty is extraordinarily hardworking. They, they work very, very hard. They are constantly trying new things for their students. We just implemented the one-to-one -one laptop environment this year. That was a big initiative and the teachers took it in stride and they just embraced it and they ran with it and I'm really, really impressed with how much they've been willing to do on their own. The beauty of it is that we're uh, living in a really important time, a revolutionary time right now for KS because uh, we are uh, implementing a one-to-one -one environment which means every student uses one computer and it takes place at a few different levels. At the elementary level it means we have iPads and laptops that the students can use to enhance their learning. We're in Apple Middle School. Every single student has an Apple computer. And at the high school, we are bringing your own laptop to school, which means the students can bring their own devices. And with technology, the most important part is to remain flexible. And I feel that uh, KS in is a very good position at the moment um, because we do have that flexibility. As we move forward into the new building, we'll be able to integrate not only all the resources that we have already, but we'll be able to bring more interactions with technology. Everyone here is very excited about the new KS. I feel very proud of this project because my role is to help to develop the concepts of this new campus. The vision is right here in front of us. <laughs> We're, we're having great plans. Uh, the building is looking very exciting. I think that's a very exciting uh, new development in the school. We're 25 years old now. And actually being able to create a school that actually breathes that, that vision. Uh, we're looking very much into developing the, the school further into the arts, making the school of the arts. And I think that is, that is a very, very exciting development for Taiwan and for the students in the south of Taiwan. My friend and I were asked by Dr. Farrell to be uh, the student representatives on the, uh, the board to help determine the new design for our school. The concept of this design, which I personally really like, is that it, the core is centered around an exhibition and a cafeteria and a library. Oh, I really feel honored to be on this project because it sort of can give back KAS some things since I've been here for 13 years and I feel very proud to uh, choose the new design for our school. It's like a dream come true, finally. We've been talking about having a new campus for years, but we never in our wildest imaginations dreamed that it would be as significant as it's going to be. But at the end of the day, we're going to have a beautiful new campus with facilities that we never thought we'd have. We never thought we'd have a swimming pool, but it's in the plans. We never thought we'd have a 400-seat theater, but here it comes. I think it's going to be a world-class school, and that's all we've been lacking. We have world-class students, and we have world-class teachers, and now we're going to have a world-class facility.